he does not want to get on this camera. He's being such a scutch. <laughs> Levi, turn your head, little muffin. I want them to see you. They've never seen you. This way. This Come here. Way. Look, buddy, this way. This way. This way. There you are. Look. I'm going to go outside on a walk, right, Yaya? Let me see the bubbles. Ooh. A helicopter. Helicopter. Hello. We got lots of masks on. My face is looking a hot mess lately. I have this on. I'll put it on in a second. I have not been taking care of my face, like my skin. I stopped taking the collagen peptides because I ran out and never got more, and that really helps with my skin. But we did some extractions. Glam Glow, Peter Thomas Roth Gold. I don't really even like that one. I have like a sample thing, but whatever. It's for firming. Heavy eye mask cream lip mask. Bye. All right, all right. Ay, the lip mask is Lenange. Lenange. Oh, and I also put on the water sleeping mask somewhere on my face. And AHA toner. Uh, I don't have a retinol. I really need to get my skincare game up. I used to be on it. Now I'm just, I'm just out here. So, hi guys. Um, three month update. It's three months and a couple days, and I have not checked the scale in a while. I'm I honestly, I'm focusing on healing my diastasis recti, and I'm doing some at-home workouts. I haven't been to the gym in like two weeks, but I am gonna start going back tomorrow. I'm gonna think I'm gonna do like three days a week cardio and like everyday strength training, either at home, Pilates, or something like. Anyway, so that's that. Slowly losing it, very slowly. Um, mental health is still good. Levi is adorable. He smiles and giggles. He's the cutest thing. He, I said I think in my last vlog that he's sleeping through the night, but all of a sudden this week he's like been waking up randomly in the middle of the night, just like, I don't know. I don't know what's going on with that. He might be teething, actually. Yay. <laughs> Two years of that. Uh, what did I want to ask you guys? Something... No, I did want to say Joe Malone perfume is now in Sephora and I'm, I don't know why that makes me excited because some malls don't have Bloomingdale's or I don't want to use. And yeah, there's a lot of good scents and I'm excited I really want to get one. I haven't had new scents since beginning of pregnancy last year and now I can never wear it again because it makes me nauseous. So, there is one that I want to buy. My hair is falling out a lot, but we'll see. We'll see how bad it gets. Right now I'm still I still have it. And I'm waiting to get like a haircut. Like I want to wait for all the hair to fall out. What else? Mariah's doing well. She might go to preschool in September. <laughs> Did I tell you? Nails? What? Who am I? First time in like two years. A year and a half maybe. Two years. No, a year and a half. I love you. My dog. How are you feeling, babe? I'm actually. Focus. 
Yeah. You don't have it. There's nothing there. Go ahead. Yeah, there's no boo boo, I don't think. Let me see. No, it's good. Good morning. I have some great news. Not that you guys care, but I care. So, first of all, this is the next morning, right? Did I say that? And besides this pimp, like massive pimple that I tried to in this too, my skin looks really good compared to yesterday. Like all the stuff I put on it. So that's good. <laughs> Secondly, I weighed myself today. Today is the July 13th. And I told out of a total since the day I started working out, have lost seven pounds. I'm 156 right now. Ooh, ooh. <coughs> Show them your earrings. Your hoops. Big girl. You're just casually wearing your dress around the house, cutie girl. <coughs> How old are you now? Two. Uh-uh. You know that, so he goes. One, two, three. That's right. Yeah. And how old's your brother? Uh, you know? five. Oh. Five. Is he? No, he's three months. Two months. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm talking. Pickles. Cool. Pickles. Excuse me. I need to go to Um. Oh, what was I saying? So yeah, I'm excited about that. Seven pounds. What are you doing, little ham sandwich? Just chilling. I used to film Mariah all the time, and I don't get to film you that much because mommy life is more difficult this time. Ow! Around. Let's say hi to my subscribers and to yourself in the future. I'm the most handsomest boy in the whole wide world. Good job. All right. We went by the pool. Wait, let me turn this off. Oh. Oh. Mommy took the kiddos, the kiddos, to the pool by herself for the first time. Isn't that amazing? I mean, we've done it before, but I not just me and you. Shows. Do you want these the pizza too? That. Just this no. What about this? Yes. Did you have fun by the pool? Yeah. I got the veggies in my heart. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Hi guys. So the battery is dying and I can't find a charger and I'm really upset because I have so many things I need to film. Actually, Satan's trying to play these games with me. It's not gonna work. But update, I lost another pound, so I'm 155.2. And although a lot to go. We're doing it. We need to lose it here. Here. <gasps> it's fine.
Hi guys. Wow, my hair is really <laughs> fluffy. As you can tell, I just got my hair done, or it's done. Shout out to Brie, brush and blush. Yeah, I had a lot of appointments. Well, it feels like a lot. It's been a busy two days. I'm out east. I stayed over my mom's last night. We had two pediatric appointments yesterday. I got waxed. I did my feet. Um, today I had my hair appointment and then I had, I had a gyno, an OBG appointment. Um, and then look at this eye. Look at it. I have a sty on top of the sty, which I don't know if you can tell, but it's like a mark. My, um, Araya literally smacked into my head two nights ago. At the same time I have a sty. I look crazy. I look like I got punched in the face. Anyway. So I stayed at my mom's. And she's with the kids now. I need to head back because I feel bad. She, it's a lot of work. <laughs> um, and I got my Starbucks. So I had a little me time. Sort of. Kind of running around. But yeah. Nice to take care of myself, you know. I, I got nails to put on because these like are about to fall off, but I'm gonna wait um, because I have a wedding next week, so I might wait a couple of days to put them on. But I wanted to just uh, jump on here and vlog because I never vlog anymore by myself. It's pouring, or it was pouring. What's this person doing? I need, you know, I need to get thing for my camera for vlogging. This is about to fall. So I can have you guys up here like the old days. Right, people. Yeah, you were late. That's so sad vlogging. Alright, lady. Person, relax. Yeah, I need to have it so I can have like a, a vlogging camera on. Yeah. What's the update? That's really it. Having a little appointment two days. And I'm exhausted. I got horrible sleep. I'm not one of those people that can just like rough it. I need my bed. 100%. Not that sleeping at my mom's is roughing it. But you know what I mean? Like some people can just sleep anywhere and be fine. Not me! Alright, I'm gonna uh, get off because this is not really safe. Ciao. So, I did want to share with you guys my Skims products I bought, and let's jump into that. So the packaging comes in this brown box, and I got two items. I got sculpting thong and the sculpting shorts in the colors orc orc i think it is yeah and i at my size i got large extra large they didn't have i think the small medium but i'm glad i didn't get it anyway because girl ain't a small medium <laughs> but i didn't know really like what to what to expect in that sense like i never tried on shapewear and skims before so so Sculpting thong. That's what it looks like. It's seamless, which is great. It's great that there's no seam down the middle. You would see that. And it's so soft. It's literally so soft. Um, and so as far as sculpting the stomach, it definitely, I wouldn't say like snatches you. Like it I think I just have a lot of extra weight, obviously, post baby. And if I, if it was back to like how my body was right before baby, this could be amazing. Um, you want to like make it more snatched, then it would definitely work. But it did help flatten and make me feel secure. I will say that. Like it did smooth out my stomach a little bit. The only thing I would say is that it really, really squeezes there. And if you don't have hips, it makes like a love hangle, love, 
love handle type thing and goes into a hip dip so I don't know I, I'm gonna try it on again I did wear it for the wedding and it worked out but um, if I was to just wear this with another dress I don't think I don't know how I'd feel about it second thing is the sculpting shorts and there's shorter ones but I got the longer ones because I'm not trying to squeeze my thigh midway and have freaking like sausage links <laughs> so I wanted it to go down to the knee basically and also so I got this mainly because like I never choose to wear light colored pants that are like fitted if they're loose it's fine but if they're like hugging my butt or my thigh or a dress that's a light colored I'm not gonna go with that color and I want to but it's I have cellulite and so it just doesn't flatter me and never has and I never had shapewear before so I'm like I want something that's just gonna smooth out my legs and my butt that I can wear like a pant or a dress or something like that so I was excited about this and I will say it does smooth everything in that sense and it does smooth out your tummy and I the mesh for the butt part if they, that she does you would think would be great but i again like i don't know if it's because of the extra weight i have or what but it makes my butt look not it makes it look like dumpy <laughs> perfect word for it like i honestly feel like my butt looks way better without it so maybe if this meshing was bigger it would work but I don't know I I'm gonna give it another shot when I lose a little more weight and I'll try it on and I'm hoping that it does work out because with a dress though I think this could work because you doesn't like with pants you're lit it's literally showing like the outlining with a dress it kind of hides I don't know how to explain it but I'll give it another shot. I did want to show you and give you my opinion on it. Um, and I am planning to lose at least another 10 pounds, maybe 15, maybe 18 pounds. So I think it could work. I think I could. And that's my skins review. What was the price? Do I have, I have a receipt? I do. Altogether, this was... Oh, no, I don't. I think it was like 79 all together so they were like 30 something a piece 36 a piece 39 36 a piece 34 something like that and the shipping was you know so i think that was a fair price a really fair price for a shapewear so good job good job skims but this is a still still to let you know how i love it i like it 50 50 maybe hey guys so i wanted to share with you what i did um for the wedding that i went to okay this is like two weeks later i was actually two pounds heavier than <laughs> this fan is so loud but um i was looking and looking for things and i actually found like such cute items but they didn't fit properly so i resorted to this dress that I bought for my best friend's wedding, but it came in late. For any postpartum moms, or anyone who has a gut, get a maternity dress, all right? You could probably get a size down, or your size, depending on the material. But it's so great because, first of all, black hides a lot of things. But this particular dress, um, the rouging on the side, like, and the extra material right here just kind of like hides everything. And then you have this bow, which also kind of hides and gives you an illusion. You know, it's just the bow covering everything. Um, and then this little like loose part. And I don't know, it, it just worked out great for me, honestly, because I had a gut and wasn't feeling like secure in that. I'm, so this kind of just made me feel better in this season. So I totally suggest you get that if you have an event it makes you feel good anyway i'm also wearing skims which i'll talk more about or maybe i did before this but uh, i'm wearing the sculpting thong the thing with this is that it kind of squeezes 
your love handle, like pushes love handles down. And if you don't have hips, which I don't, I don't know if you can tell, see? These two little like things. It, and then you have a hip dip, so it's just kind of funny. But if you have hips, it probably just goes into it and looks great. So I mean, I guess it depends on your body type. But with this dress, it kind of worked because it's like that material. You don't know if it's the material or not. Uh, I'll definitely try it on again with something else soon. But it worked for this. And get you a maternity dress. Life hack. I will, yeah, show you what I, how it looked that night. And this dress is from Boohoo. So cheap. Even the material, like, it's not cute. It, it's cute from afar and for pictures. And it feels good. But, like, you know what I mean? Like the material is just like, okay, it's not well made at all. But it worked. Hey guys, I really need to get a thing for this, like I said. I am currently on my way to go return some items from Zara that I picked up for the wedding to try on because they don't have fitting rooms. Freaking morons. Seriously though, like get it together. Does that piss anyone else off? It's like they can give two ish about the customer like and they're so rude the employees sorry if you're uh an employee there and you're not rude but every almost everyone that i've ever come across and the ones that i go to just are i don't know and anyway i don't get it because they're just getting long lines and lots and lots of returns and items that have to be like got thrown away so just open up the fitting rooms what rant over um yeah and i'm also going to get some skincare and pick up a couple items for myself because you know what i need to, to pamper myself a little bit i the past 12 hours and it's been really rough levi has been waking up in the middle of the night and everything done not rushing and be able to sit in the car for like 10 15 minutes and just rest and write out my grocery list and pick up a ride after my appointment and go to Whole Foods. Danny's with them right now. Just having a day in the mood you know but I'm happy I'm out. I'm, I am glad to be out by myself and sometimes like I feel bad because I don't I like to bring her I genuinely love to be with Araya like hang out with her and take her places now 
which is so cool to say that. But and I, I love that she gets out too. But uh, you know what? I was like, no, I, I do need this time. And so here I am. Good job, mom. And I need to get all the way. Um. Oh, this is what I wanted to say. This is like so cool that even though I have my days like now overall like I'm doing a lot better this brown dew my baby and even yesterday like this is such a cool thing Danny was gone to Joey and Tony's bachelor at bachelor vineyards thing and I couldn't go because I had the kids but I I was with them, and then you know what? By like three o'clock, I'm like, let's go by the pool, let's get out. Um, so we did, and it's that was like my second or third time, just me and them. Like I go only go with them by myself if it's not so 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 hot, and um, you know I don't think I believe I can handle it sitting in that thing. So anyway, did that. Yeah, did it, was fine. And as I'm by the pool, um, some people from our building that Danny knows actually, I was with them, talking to them, hanging out, but, oh, I need that spot, wait, wait, wait. But the, the wife was like, I just have to say you're glowing and like, you make this look easy. It's amazing. And I'm like, um, thank you. That is such a good compliment. And she had a, a two-year-old. And she's like, you know, I'm struggling with my one. And um, I'm a hermit. I stay in the house. And my husband's more of a socialite. It's like my first time out. And I'm like, oh my gosh. I'm the same. Don't, don't feel like that. Like, I am the same. Like, I, I get it. I totally get it. And honestly... It, I felt with, with, with Araya, I, it was so much harder on me, like, now, this time. Anyway, we were talking, and, um, but the point is, like, what a testimony is that? Like, the fact that I'm getting that compliment shows God's mercy and grace and, um, like, work in my life. Because, like, me getting compliments as I make it look easy being a mom, you know what I mean? Um, it's just incredible. The growth. So I had to say that because if you are struggling as a mom or if you are just depressed or whatever, like just at your wit's end, you know what? There is hope and you will, the trials create endurance, endurance, character. I forget the verse, but God will work through it for you and, and use it for his good. So one day you might someone might be looking up to you or maybe they are now okay just have to say that so cool all right i'm gonna go and spend some time by myself